top 8 Linux distributions for 2025. Welcome to this video where we dive into the exciting world of Linux and explore why it's becoming more popular than ever. As we approach the mid of 2025, many believe Linux could hit a 10% market share thanks to its flexibility, security, and open source nature. Today, I am sharing my top 8 Linux distributions that are leading the charge, offering something for everyone. Whether you are a tech enthusiast, a creative professional, or just curious about switching from Windows or Mac OS. Let's take this journey together and discover what makes these distributions stand out. Number 1. Pop OS First up is Pop OS, developed by System76. This has been my go-to distribution for years, especially on System76 hardware where it delivers unmatched performance. Pop OS is known for its sleek design and efficiency, making it ideal for modern systems. As of July 2025, the highly anticipated Cosmic Desktop is still in its alpha stages, promising even greater usability and performance once fully released. If you need a versatile, powerful Linux distribution, for newer hardware, Pop OS is a fantastic choice. You can check it out at system76.com slash pop. Number 2. Ubuntu Budgie Next is Ubuntu Budgie. A beautiful blend of Ubuntu's reliability and the stunning Budgie desktop environment. This distribution is both gorgeous and highly customizable letting you tailor the desktop to your liking. It's so appealing that I often consider switching from Pop OS, but the seamless integration with System76 hardware keeps me anchored. Ubuntu Budgie is perfect for users who want a visually appealing and flexible desktop. You can learn more at ubuntubudgie.org website. Number 3. Rhino Linux Third on the list is Rhino Linux, a rolling release distribution based on Arch Linux. Its XFCE desktop is strikingly beautiful, and while new spins have been announced, they are still in development as of July 2025. Rhino Linux keeps you on the cutting edge with the latest software updates and offers multiple package managers for flexibility. If you love staying up to date and want a visually stunning desktop, Rhino Linux is worth exploring. You can visit at rhinolinux.org for details. Number 4 is Bodhi Linux. Fourth is Bodhi Linux, a lightweight distribution that holds a special place in my heart due to its Moksha desktop, which is based on Enlightenment. It's perfect for reviving older hardware. Thanks to its minimal resource demands, features like the innovative desktop menu and window shading add a unique flair. While it may have a learning curve for newcomers, its Ubuntu-based reliability and extensive theming options make it a gem. You can check it out at bodhilinux.com website. Number 5. Elementary OS Fifth is Elementary OS, a distribution that shines with its Mac OS-like Pantheon desktop. Its consistent, elegant design and privacy-focused features like Secure Session make it a standout. Elementary OS is especially welcoming for Linux beginners, offering a familiar and intuitive interface. If you are looking for a polished, user-friendly experience, Elementary OS is a top pick. You can explore it at elementary.io website. Number 6 is Ubuntu. Sixth is Ubuntu, the cornerstone of many Linux distributions. Known for its ease of use, robust hardware support, 
and long-term support releases. Ubuntu is a safe bet for anyone transitioning from Windows. Its consistency and reliability make it a go-to choice for both new and seasoned users. If you are considering Linux, try dual booting with Ubuntu to test the waters. You can visit ubuntu.com for more information. Number 7 is Fedora. 7th is Fedora, which has made significant strides in performance, especially with versions like Fedora 40. Sponsored by Red Hat. Fedora is a cutting edge distribution that's fast and beautiful, particularly with its KDE spin. It's ideal for users who want the latest features and don't mind a slightly experimental experience. Fedora's versatility makes it a strong contender. You can learn more at getfedora.org website. Number 8 is Zorin OS. Last but not least is Zorin OS. Designed with the newcomers in mind. Its ability to switch between desktop layouts, mimicking Windows, Mac OS, or other styles, make it incredibly approachable. The free version is feature rich, while the Pro Edition offers additional layouts for even more flexibility. Zorin OS is perfect for those transitioning to Linux. You can check it out at zorinos.com. Finally, the conclusion. Linux is on an upward trajectory and distributions like PopOS, Ubuntu Budgie, Rhino Linux, Bodhi Linux, Elementary OS, Ubuntu, Fedora and Zorin OS are paving the way. Whether you prioritize performance, aesthetics, lightweight design or ease of use, there is a Linux distribution for you. As we are at mid-2025, I believe Linux growth will continue, potentially hitting the 10% market share milestone. If you haven't explored Linux yet, now's the perfect time to start. Which distribution are you excited to try? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech content. Why Linux is poised for growth? Linux open source nature allows for constant innovation driven by a global community of developers. Its security features like full disk encryption in Pop OS and privacy-focused options like elementary OS Secure Session appeal to users vary for proprietary systems. Additionally, Linux flexibility caters to diverse needs, from reviving old hardware with both Linux to powering modern workstations with Fedora. Thanks for watching and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Peace out.